Hello there, um, in this video I will talk about sieve of Eratosthenes. I don't know if I pronounce it, it correctly, but um, it's not important. Um, this uh, method uh, is used to find uh, prime numbers between uh, a range of numbers. Um, and how it works. Let's see. Uh, for this example we will search for uh, primes between 1 and uh, 100. Uh, we get the numbers 1 to 100 and the 1 is not uh, a prime as you may know um next we will find the square root of the max number the max number in this case is uh, a hundred and the square root of a hundred is ten why we need this for uh, this is the max number that we will find multiples um, you will see in the next step so at the beginning we will find multiples of 2 so 2 times 2 is 4 we mark the number 4 here and next 2 times 3 is 6. We mark the 6. Times 4, we mark the 8. We mark the 10. Times 6, we mark 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, and 30. 32, 34 and 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78 and 80. 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, and 100. Um, for this number we don't need to search more because we reach the maximum number that we want to know. Uh, next we go uh, find the multiples of 3 is the next number here so we do the same thing as we did before so uh, 3 times 2 is equals to 6 we already marked this number uh, but 3 times 3 is 9 so we mark again the number 9 uh, times 4 is 12 already marked times 5 is 15 and we mark the number here uh, times 6 is already times 7 is 21 24 is already marked 27 we mark in the table 30 is already marked 33 is not marked yet so we mark uh, 36 is already marked 39 is not marked and we mark it um, 42 45 48 and 51 50 54 is already marked, 
57 we mark it and 60 is already marked 63 we mark 69 75 81 87 93 and 99 so we reach the, the maximum so we go to the next uh, number but the next number is already marked so we go to the 5 so we will find the multiples of 5 we start again 5 times 2 is equals to 10 and is already marked uh, times 3 is already already marked 2 uh, 20 25 is a new number so we mark this number 30 35 is a new number 2 we mark it here and 40 45 50 55 is a new number 6 65 is a new number to 70 75 80 85 is a new number so we mark it and 90 95 we mark it again so uh, 100 is already marked so um, Next, we have the 6 number, the 6 is already taken, so we will take the number 7 and we will we'll do the same thing as 7 times 2 is 14 and 21 and 28 and 35, 42 49 is a new number so we mark it in the numbers map uh, 56 63 70 77 is a new number and we mark it 84 is already marked 91 is a new number 98 is already marked and we reached the the end um, since that we have the eight nine and ten already marked we will never we will not search uh, for multiples of eight nine and ten and remember uh, as I said before the ten is the maximum number to find multiples okay so the search is finished um, now we remove the marked numbers like this and let's clear it a bit and the remaining numbers are all prime numbers so what we have did uh, here was finding multiples of numbers uh, if is a multiple um, you can divide by a number that is not itself so it's not a prime number okay and these numbers uh, are all prime numbers so let's do let's go to the implementation in Python here so at the beginning we will we will find the maximum number to be checked like this is an integer of mat square root the of limits the limit is uh, the maximum number 
in the that we want to find and we build uh, prime numbers um, list for x in range 2 limit plus 1 this uh, builds uh, a list with 2, 3, 4, 5 to 100 um, for n in prime numbers for each number in prime numbers we do if number is equals to minus 1 we continue we go to the next number if the number is bigger than max number to be checked we stop we break the the for loop okay now we declare a variable called m and m is equals to n to the number and for each x in range of m plus uh, oops plus m minus 2 and when of prime numbers we jump m numbers like this and we go to the prime numbers list sorry at position x and we assign the number minus 1 what we are doing is marking the position with a number minus 1 um, after this loop we go to the next number if the number is not marked we can't we go and if the number is bigger than the maximum number to be checked we stop but if not we will check for each uh, we will mark every multiple of our number uh, maybe you are thinking why I'm I put this minus 2. Why? Because the list starts at number 2. Okay, I ignored the number 1. It's just because of it. So, uh, next. Next. Um, well, we actually have a list with numbers and uh, seri numbers between 2 and 100 and uh, the numbers that are not prime numbers I just assign with the minus 1 so if we go here and return um, i for i in prime numbers if i is different than minus 1 so I'm getting all the numbers that are different than minus 1 okay let's see this if this works if we don't have any error oops yes it's work it works so 
why what I am saying here is I'm searching for primes between uh, 1 and 100 and I'm pr printing the list the list is here and I'm printing the number of numbers that we find is 25 um, let's try with a bigger number like this and we get 12, 29 numbers the list are here Whoa. it's big let's try with with a million let's see if this works this works uh, 78, 49, 8 numbers and 10 millions It's pretty pretty fast, but I want something different. Now we are testing a hundred millions, and I hope this uh, break in a useful time. Yes, it breaks. It breaks why? Because call to respect call to this ba -ba 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 -ba. memory error. It's what I I am searching for. So uh, one hundred million we have a memory memory error. Why? Because this computer doesn't have uh, enough memory and I didn't configure it uh, for that um, to to have uh, a list enough big enough to to have a hundred million um, numbers so uh, prime numbers are very important numbers why? because of this uh, it's very complicated to found uh, bigger prime numbers and they are actually used in the major security systems and algorithms because of that because you need actually a very very powerful computer to find these numbers so this is the implementation of um, sieve of Aristotens. Tennis, no, I don't know. Um, hope you liked it, and thanks for watching. Bye.